And so here he is, the inimitable former UFC champion, Yuri Prohaska. And I say former, but never lost the belt in the octagon. 13 consecutive wins when injury intervened. Yuri Prohaska is an absolute savage. This is a guy that made his way to the UFC in a very short period of time, became the champion. He has tremendous power. He has an uncanny ability to find the shot that ends his opponent's night. He's scary. He is a true mixed martial artist, or martial artist, as I say, with the mind of a champion. And it's very exciting to see Yuri Prohaska back in the octagon. And I'm glad you bring up the championship mindset, because anyone who may be doubted as to whether or not he had the ticker, you got your answers in Singapore at UFC 275. Let's see how it goes for Prohaska here tonight. because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are gonna wanna stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting the takedowns right yeah. away. for this heavyweight championship fight. Now to get us started, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> twitching on the canvas, so we'll see how the opponent chooses to defend Bruce Lee here in the early go. Well, you can spot that wide base, that stance of Yuri Prohaska from a mile away. His opponent didn't see that right hand coming. Yeah, that right hand is, is tremendous from Yuri Prohaska, but that right hand starts with that wide base, with his ability to draw it. Your mistake, and then he always capitalizes on it. Right hook attempt, that's a miss. How good is this action about a minute in? I think I'm gassing out just watching this thing. I'm exhausted trying to call <laughs> all the strikes that these two men are throwing at each other. What a fun fight. Yeah, I hate to be the punch counter tonight. <laughs> well, he misses with the left punch there. Slips. Oh, beautiful job to get the kick home to the body. 
that shot blocked by Prohaska. Heavy leather landed on both sides in that exchange. Oh, nice straight there by Prohaska. Well, the one thing about throwing jabs is that when you throw a jab, you kind of set your, your, your lead leg because you're trying to extend on the jab. If a person has good timing on leg kicks, they will land almost every time. So you got to be careful. Oh, I think he's still compromised. We'll see if he can recover here. He's in a world of trouble. There you go. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, the kick landed. Beautiful jab there by the champ. And there's that jab. Rips the body there. Able to land there with the straight left. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment. John, it may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Oh, picture perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Oh, big left. Out of range with that kick attempt. So now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal to go to the body and the discipline to stay with that approach. I mean, it's just tremendous. You, you see a fighter with a high fight IQ following a game plan and it's working. It's hurt bad. Big left hand lands upstairs. Oh, with authority the body. Looking to counter with his left hand, but he misses. Protect yourself. Protect Under a minute now to go in the round. Oh, strong punch there by Lee. Oh. Oh, and there he goes again, working off that beautiful jab. He continues to keep his opponent at distance. I mean, keeps him at bay with that beautiful, precise jab. It is like a piston. It goes in and out, and before his opponent can even realize what hit him, he's already hitting him with another one. Right. I love, love watching this man fight because of that beautiful, educated jab. Nice punch here. He gets to the single collar tie. Look for him to drive and move his opponent to find openings to land that free hand. Oh, that body shot hurt him. Ten seconds now in round one. Oh, what a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. All right, so the round is over, and you see some obvious bleeding now. Looks like the cut is on the nose. Yes, it is. Cut man will try to get in there and shut it, but of course, as soon as he absorbs the strike this next round, that thing could reopen. Certainly bears watching here moving forward. All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned a huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to, to try to change the tide of this Good. fight. All right, round two. All right, so as this next round gets up. Oh! Ooh. Oh, nice job by him to get the knee to the target there, using his length exceptionally well tonight. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. So he's really starting to put together some significant... Oh! He's hurting him bad, man. That right hook is nasty. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Lee. Nice, good, strong. 
Investing in the body with the kick there. Oh, and he counters with a straight left. That landed flush. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. All right, so he continues to land a high volume of strikes. He talked to us a lot about pace and pressure, and he is certainly... That is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, big left hook there. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Big right hand. Oh, nice body shot. Takedown defense holds up. Man, how good is that? The hard hook lands again. Oh. This could be it. Oh! Unable to connect with the right hand there. Just over three minutes to go in round two. Man has his chin been tested early. Oh, nice. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the ball. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Prohaska's got a lot of weapons on both sides as he switches guy, his stance here. Man, that is loud. Another strike lands for the kickboxer. He really found that flow state pretty early in this fight, and he hasn't looked back. He found it really early. And when this guy gets into his groove, he is hell on wheels. And right now he is showing why he is such a high-level, high-regarded kickboxer. He is outclassing this guy. Just over two minutes now to go. Lee is swelling now around the jaw area, so we'll keep an eye on that as this fight continues. Oh, solid kicks are landing. He has most certainly found the range on the feet. Huge block there. Oh, big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that finish. Nice shot there by the champ. Started. Oh! <laughs> Lee going for the head kick. He misses there. Well, his opponent seemed to be stunned to a significant extent, but was able to recover, and it's almost like he let him off the hook. Kind of let him off the hook. He needed to really put his foot on the gas to try to find that finish. Slips the punch. Less than a minute to go in the round. Oh. Both tough, both durable, both unwilling to take a step back. What a phenomenal fight. Huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Well, you know this is the hurt business, and both guys are compromised at this stage of the fight. Yeah, both guys are compromised. Both guys have been beat up. Both guys have done a great job of landing, recognizing what they wanted to get done, and it's showing. This is a very evenly matched fight. Oh, he's in a lot of trouble now. Oh, my goodness. So, fighter a little bit stunned, holding on to him now, not doing a ton, just looking to recover. Two rounds in the books. All right, mercifully, that is it for the round, and Prohaska's got a real significant cut above the eye. We'll see if the cut man can stop the bleeding. All right, let us get you some replays from that previous round. He certainly got a lot done on the feet, and as such, he has opened up a pretty significant gash above his opponent's eye. Yeah, it was a buildup. He just kept popping him. He kept hitting him until something opened him up. And now he can see the damage that he's inflicting. Nothing feels better to a fighter than to see the person wearing your work. 
That is exactly Ready. what's going on right now. And the cut man is not the only one that is going to keep an eye on that wound as this next round gets underway. Oh, the roundhouse kick lands. Lee's kick, that one blocked. And he switches to Southpaw. Just out of range with that right here. And then, oh, that's a huge connection here, DC. He massive, is hurt. Massive hook lands, and his opponent seems to be on his way out of the fight. Left hook, right hand. All right, so the redness is omnipresent now. He has absorbed a whole lot of body strikes. Pretty good poker face, but I'm not sure how many more of these he wants to take. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Well, informed speculation says he's going to try to set up another hook here. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Oh, nice jab by Lee. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. It doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. All right, so he earned respect from his opponent early on with the power, and now the swelling really started to become a factor, champ. The swelling starting to become a factor. This guy is so good at recognizing a weakness in his opponent. He got him hurt, he got him swollen a little bit, and now, it's starting to pay dividends. Just over three minutes now to go. Push kick there to the body. Well, some... Oh, oh, there, he landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot that will finish the fight. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Back and forth we go. It takes two to tango, and man, have these two individuals tangoed tonight. I might... Oh! Yeah, he hurt him real bad. He still hurt. Great setup. That was a nasty high kick. Back and forth we go. With two minutes and change to go in round three. Oh, there's the swing and there's the miss by Lee. Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. He blocked that punch. Prohaska's really targeting that cut right now, and why not? He has opened up his opponent. Might as well continue to attack that particular area. Back kick there. Telegraph that spinning back fist. He's got him hurt here. Huge left hand. One minute now to go in the third. Trouble. Oh! Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Lee's kick to the body here. That one appeared to be blocked. Well, you know he's tougher than I am, right? But this man has absorbed so much damage upstairs that I wouldn't be surprised to see the referee calling the doctor at some point. But at some point, you got to take a look at him. He's so bruised. He's so battered. He's so swollen. And credit to his opponent for finding a route to victory and staying on that. He has dominated this fight. Final seconds here. Oh, 
All right, that's three rounds in the books. We are headed to the championship rounds. All right, there's the horn. An appreciative crowd responding in kind. He rocked his opponent multiple times there in that round. Looked very confident in doing so. They might even bring in the RP here. I mean, he was. it was relaxation at its finest. Just so relaxed, so comfortable in the fire, which then allowed him to land these big strikes that had his opponent buzz on many, many occasions. But he cannot get desperate. Don't go crazy trying to finish the fight. Let it come to you. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. All right, so here we go. Fourth round is underway. What is the fighter's mentality when you enter those seminal championship rounds? You understand that you are getting close now. The night is... Yeah. He's hurt. Oh, hit kick blocked, though, by Prohaska. Straight punch. That is useful. Misses again with a right punch. Oh, oh my goodness. Perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Oh! He comes forward with a flying knee that just missed hitting the target flush. Keep that pressure high now. Watch for him to set up that hook again now. His eye is essentially swollen shut at this point in time, and I'm not sure there's any end swell. Oh! You heard him. All right, so back to the hook shot there as predicted, but unable to connect. Well, he's the taller fighter and able to land a knee to the body with relative ease there. Oh, he's feeling it now. Nice combination there by Lee. Just over three minutes to go. All right, well, that blow is fauceting from that cut with each strike landed, and he continues to effectively target that area. You know, we are talking about a guy with a super high fight IQ. So when you give him that blood, that crimson red is nothing more than something that inspires him to continue doing what he's doing. So you have got to change something. You got to get your head moving so you're not taking too much damage to that cut. Back and forth we go. Well, I think I can smell the blood at this point in time. That canvas didn't look like that a few fights ago. Blood is flowing from that cut with every passing strike. Every strike. And it burns. John, it burns so bad. When you get cut like that, every time a shot lands, it just burns. So this guy needs to try to find a way to not take and limit the damage he's taken to this cut. Easier said than done, though. Right hook to the head block. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Lee's cut on his nose, manageable for a while, maybe not so much now. That thing is pouring blood. Nice jab there. 90 seconds to go. Clifton with a right hand there. Well, at this point, he's got to be way up on the judges' scorecards, clearly winning the fight, and largely has gotten it done with his striking time. He got it through, but he's had a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Oh, that's big. Landed a solid punch there. All right, so a good job by him here. He continues to block these shots. Seems to see them coming a mile away. He sees them coming a mile away, and he's blocked, and he's rolling, he's slipping. He's doing a great job. Hands high, hands high. Oh, no pad on the foot. That's a solid kick right there. 
nasty high kick. How is he still standing? Slips the back. Thirty seconds to go here. It's work, guys. Please. Oh! He's hurt bad. Fifteen seconds to go. Effective strike there by Pro Hoska. Man, these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Oh, beautiful combination. 20 minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, good news is the round is over. Bad news, Lee's eye is worse for wear. That's completely swollen shut at this point in time. You know the ringside physician is going to come in and take a look, but you got to think the vision, at least in that eye, is completely compromised at this point in time. All right, so back to the stools we go. They say defense wins championships, and he has not defended well tonight. He isn't trying, or at least it doesn't seem like he's trying. He has got to move his head. He's trying to react when the punch is already coming, and that's not working. If he takes many more of these shots, this fight is going to be stopped due to the swap. Right on the button. Tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Oh, thwack. That is a solid kick right there. Oh, and he lands a knee of the body now, DC. Talk to us about that strike. They suck so bad, especially when you're going forward. You walk full speed to a knee to the body. It could in the night. Lee's strike attempt there is blocked. Nice high kick. Oh. oh, he's got him hurt badly now. Big right hand. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Pro Hoska. Another nasty punch lands. Slip that offering from his opponent. In the past, we've seen him sort of lean on the toughness. Tonight, he's leaning on the defense. And you see the evolution of the fighter in front of him. Oh, what a connection right off the gut. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he doesn't know where he is. He's hurt real bad. That punch landed in the perfect spot. Well, you see him cringing now as the body damage just continues to pile up. He hasn't made the adjustments, and I wouldn't even hate a stoppage here. No, I wouldn't hate a stoppage here. This guy's been beat up. Like, he hasn't adjusted. Oh, he's got to start throwing down. There's the leg kick. That one checked by Pro Hoska. All right, well, time is the enemy now, DC, and he's really running out of it if he's going to get his hand raised tonight. He's got to go forward. He's got to just throw everything at his opponent to try and find that punch or that kick that's going to end the fight. There is no time for strategy. Stay heavy on that cut. Let's go. Get it. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by Lee. Over and over, he is landing punches to the head. Doing work with the jab there. Well, I am not going out on a limb when I say he is on the wrong side of this fight. Maybe a little bit rattled after getting knocked down earlier in the round. But that's exactly what you expect, right? He took such a bad knockdown early. It's going to be on him to build back into this fight as we go forward. Oh, oh he's wobbled now. Spinning ball fist. Oh, both. Both landed. Under two minutes now to go in the fight. Just misses with the straight right. Well, no denying the durability on the other side, but at this point, you just got to find that kill shot and get him out of there. A lot of times that comes with reps 
that comes with taking your time. You get excited and you want to finish with this big right there. Oh, he gets up here, but he is on wobbly legs. Big right hand lands. Sidekick now. It is hard to hear ourselves on the headsets. This place is going crazy after one of the best fights of the year. Both men put it all on the line. Just really a sight to behold from minute one of this fight. Well, they told us. They both told us. Strap in. This is going to be one of the best fights you've ever seen. And boy, has it delivered. We have seen blood. We have seen heart. We have seen spirit. We have seen these two lay it on the line against each other. But hey, it takes two to tangle. But we had the two right guys in the octagon tonight to produce an instant classic. Establishing the jab. Oh, a huge strike lands there. And somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Final seconds of the fight. Oh. He's done, he's done. Whoa! Yuri Prohaska has done it! I mean, wow. And here we go inside the octagon for the official decision. So Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 52 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Yuri Denisa Koshasa. Everything about this guy is watchable, right? Even after the fact, a big knockout for Yuri Prohaska here tonight, and this dude's just getting started, champ. He's so fun. I mean, 